Welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. We're here with a box of Ether Revolt because it's my turn to hit a lottery card. And I am going to hit one of the best inventions that you'll ever see hit on a video. It's going to be Mana Crypt. So we're going to scream through the packs just so I can get to what I want to get to. But while I'm sorting things out, if you're looking for ways to support the channel, there's a few of them. The first one is the easiest, and it's completely free. You just have to become a subscriber. Hit that thumbs up button. If you'd like us to crack some packs for you, which we love doing, hit the link below, become a patron of the channel, join that Patreon link. And the final way is to head out to noblenight.com and purchase from them. Supporting them supports us. So noblenight.com. And I am going to spend an extra second just looking through the uncommons because we have fatal pushes that are pretty good. Our first rare is Aether Geode Miner. I actually don't know these cards that well. And then Countless Gears Renegade. I did not get to play a whole lot of Kaladesh or any of these sets, so I'm going to be going in blind a little bit. I just know I want an invention and that it's going to happen. Just looking for that shine at the back end. Got Baral, Chief of Compliance. One of the solid rares from this set. And, who we already got a foil rare. We got the Aether Tide Whale. With its broken energy mechanic. It doesn't matter. It's the foil rare there is not the one we're looking for. And that's okay. Because it doesn't take up my invention spot. And Rishkar's Expertise. A really solid card. Especially for you commander players. It's a real, real, real good one. I'm trying to think what else is good here. Walking Ballista. I think a Johnny is slowly climbing up to the Planeswalker. I think is a good one. I got our first Mythic, the Aetherwind Basker. Big fat lizard man. Not bad. I keep thinking of the Gear Hulks, but that is Kaladesh. So what are the other Mythics here? We're going to find out. Gifted Aetherborn, this was a pretty solid card. And then we got Release the Gremlins. Come on. Come on. I'm looking, looking here, Brett. Uh, Paradox Engine. Oh, that's right. Paradox Engine. 19 ish bucks. Yeah, that's a good yeah, one. That's a pretty big drop off from there after walking Ballista. Pia's Revolution. Yeah. Yeah, you get a handful of single digits, you know, that are three dollars and up, but yeah, fatal push. Yeah, two, three bucks, right? Yeah, I mean, on goldfish it's three seventy five. There you go. Stram senior edificer. Look at that dwarf. Nice to see the dwarfs back. I've been gone since like the onslaught block, at least as a functional tribal piece. Maybe I'm wrong. Are they land destruction dwarves? Eh, some of them are, yeah. Midnight Entourage, Aetherborn. And another foil we've got Caught in the Brights. Look at that blinding eye. Come on, I feel it. Feel the extra weight of an invention. It's here somewhere. And another mythic, we got Indomitable Creativity. And an Invigorated Rampage with more gremlins. I didn't know that's how gremlins looked. That was derpy looking. I'm used to the, the better version of gremlins. The Mogwai version. Was it Kaladesh that also has the inventions? Yeah. Inventions. Yeah, I think that's part of why that's it's still so expensive. Lifecrafters Bestiary. This is a solid card. Not super high value, but real good for Commander, especially those creature decks. And the Felidar Guardian, the banned card from Standard because of the unlimited combo. I guess I know the set well enough to know that. Just a 
extension. That'd be fun. Consulate Crackdown. Look at all these gremlins everywhere. Just causing all sorts of panic and pain. Ornithopter. That's a pretty one. And the Aether Sphere Harvester. Come on. This pack feels heavy. A little heavier? Oh, yeah. A little more coily? Yeah, this one's heavy. It's going to be a good one. It's because the rare has so much value in it. Trophy Mage. Hey! Oh, nice. Ballista. A one of the good ones. Good, good rare. You can't have enough of those. No, that's... That is non -inventions. First or second best card you can get out of here. Yeah. Let me get the other one. Yeah, Winding Constrictor. Another fun card. And Call for Unity. Seems like a very political card. It is. Come together. Everybody wants to be friends. No. I don't want a couple of those. Disallow is a solid card. For Commander, I can't help but think about it, but being able to counter a spell or an ability, real nice. Multi purpose. Looks like we're almost about halfway through, so we got still plenty of chances to invent something. Peace Walker Colossus. Where are all of the Fatal Pushes? Solemn Recruit. More Dwarves. Dwarf Tribal. I wonder if that one... Modern Horizons, if there's going to be some dwarves reprinted, make them modern legal. Some Onslaught dwarves. Carry Zev's Expertise. I do like the Expertise cards. This is the worst one, but they are pretty cool. I love the absurdly specific names. Yeah. <laughs> Just hope they don't find their spark and become a planeswalker. Oh, no. Another gifted Aetherborn. These used to be like $2. And the Green Belt Rampager, another good one for energy. This was one of the ones I did play early on, I guess, when I came back to Magic and was playing standard. I did try to run that a little bit for a green Stompy deck. Oh, Fatal Push. There, there we go. Put that in the rare pile. And Metallic Mimic, another good one. I think this one actually has pretty decent value, too. A staple for any tribal commander you are building. That card should every single time be in it. It is super good. Oh, I see a planeswalker. I cheated. We got Tezzeret the Schemer. Up to those nasty schemes. Ooh, and a foil ornithopter. I feel like that actually probably has okay value. It just looks amazing. So we got three mythics, doing pretty good. Feel real good if we can get a couple more. Mm, see a foil, Baral's expertise, another one of the really solid expertise cards, and a foil renegade map. I don't think the camera's doing j justice, but some of these foils look really cool. I think my lighting isn't as good. Up in the north woods. You just can't see as well as you can when you're in my basement. That sounded really creepy. It's weird. <laughs> Carrie Zev's Skyship Raider. And the Foil Mountain. Ooh, always take those. Like a good foil land. And another mountain. Put it in one of your 8,000 commander decks. Yeah, there's a lot of them. They're all over the place. Another reason to become a patron, March's buy list, sell list, sell list, is going to be posted soon, like 100 cards on there, 
Some really good stuff, and it's under the market price. Quick Smith Spy. So, if you're not a patron now, become one and get in on those deals. I guess now it's we're shooting this on the 28th of February. It's probably by the time I post this, mid March. So, hey, get on it. Heroic Intervention, another solid one. Love having a handful of these for Commander as well. And then a Defiant, Defiant Salvager. A handful of packs left, uh, maybe with a nine or so packs. What's a Defiant Salvager? Just someone who refuses to stop salvaging? Yep, they just want to keep... <laughs> They're just really stubborn about it? Yeah, frugal. They're just good about that thing. Hey, Exquisite Archangel. Another Mythic. What's a set for? I'm going to pull one aside here, bro. All right, do it. Show me, is that the one that's the invention? Oh, I hope so. Does it feel heavy? I don't know. Hard to oh, tell. Oh. Glint sleeve siphon. This is about as close as standard is ever going to see again to a. Oh, I can't think of his name. Dark Confidant. This is a pretty solid oh. card. Not quite as good as that, but still very good. Digging through those extra draws if you can have the energy. Work. Paradox engine in that one. Ooh, I like that Paradox Engine, guys. Yes. X-rate it real quick. Ooh. Yehenny's Expertise. Love being able to cast additional spells for free. There's a single name there. Yehenny. The first last name. Yehenny. I hope I'm saying that right. Yanni. Yanni. Yeah. The famous piano player. Merchant's Dockhand. Terrible card. Moving on. <laughs> Yep. Just a poop rack. Yep. Insert noise. Yep. Well, there's going to be a lot of poop in this. It's all about getting that big head. <laughs> Green Wheel Liberator. Getting down there, man. At least, at least get one more super solid there. Get the engine going. Is the Paradox engine a mythic, though? Or is it a rare? Just a, you know, I don't know. Oh, Pat, I think we did it. I see it. Is it really? Yeah. Oh! oh yes! Oh, oh man. Oh, yes! There it is, guys. So, hey, well, here's the one rare. We'll move on. I don't see care. Salvage. Don't care about anything else. Chalice of the Void. Oh, yes! There it is. The invention was hit. Oh, and that's a right in the freaking close. good one. Yeah, woof -da. Oh, show that, me, a little, that needs a little more. You want more camera time, Chalice? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm just sorry ready. for your bleeding ears, but not sorry. I'm going to just get through the rest oh, of the pack so I can put a sleeve on that God. card and move on. Well, hey, how many more Mythics can we get, I guess? Because that counts, right? Aid from the Cowl. Nobody cares. I don't even know if I can put the prices up fast enough and they can go away fast enough for how these last two packs are going to go because I'm just going to fly through them. That is... <laughs> I'm guessing that's a good one. Hope of Giripper. And we got the invention. Lottery I'll card check, hit. I'll goldfish just to see. I mean, we'll have to the price on when the yeah. next video comes out. But... Price is there. You already saw it. Chalice on goldfish at least is 184. Oh. It's a good hit. Whir of Invention is another really good card. I'll show it for a second. This is good for tutoring up a lot of specific artifacts. I've got to steal this. I'm saving your pack for the end to see if the Paradox can zoom in. Oh, man. I mean, that is a beautiful card. Oh, I see another Mythic. Holy cow, this box. So Johnny Unyielding, a great Mythic. The better Planeswalker in this, in this set, but we got them both. And another Foil Rare. Scrap Trawler, this is a ridiculous box. For a set that is fading in price, all the hits, and supposedly this is the Paradox Engine for the last pack. If you haven't hit the thumbs up yet, shame on you. Please make sure you do that, because we got the invention. And we got Rishkar, Rishkar himself. Great card. Is the last rare in the close, and again, 
our Chalice of the Void successfully sleeved up. <laughs> nice little hit. Inventions are here. Hit the thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this where we chase inventions. There's going to be a lot more chasing for Jaces. There's lots of Masters boxes. And you know what? Like I said before, hit the thumbs up.